Yo, hey, Ross. Hey, um, you, you might be waiting there for a really long time, bro. Now, look at this. Holy fuck, that was so sick. I'm gonna wrap some of this up just in case I stack. I really don't want this stuff to break. We'll wrap the Sony up as well. Just a bit of extra padding. This bad boy can take it though. This is the current setup. I'm gonna have the backpack. Always gonna be making sure to wear a helmet. Got the Lakers jersey on. I'm actually keen to snowboard in it. All right guys, let's fucking go. So this is the main area that we're staying in. Just up there is the gondola and that'll take us all the way up to the mountain. But my snowboard's just waiting for me over there. This is my bad boy. Oh, thanks man, appreciate it. Cheers. Oh yeah, you will not miss me, there's no way. All right, we've got a whole gondola to ourselves, let's go. It's starting to arrive now, oh, a bit fucking shaky. Let's get this. Put our board here. All right, I think our first shot has to be just straight up the mountain. I wonder if landscape's better. I actually think portrait's the best way for this one. I'm gonna have to shoot with a fast aperture. Nice. Gotta see if Hayden picks up. Just spoke to Hayden. He should be coming down this run at some point. These shots though that require like movement is gonna be really hard for me to show you the shot that I'm getting. Cause the way that I'm doing it is getting my iPhone out and showing you guys the composition. But I can't do two things at once. Oh, there's Jake. There's Jake and Nicola. Three, two, one. What's up? I just got a cool snap at you guys. What's happening? Bring it in. Oh, yeah. Good, how are you going? That's a hug. Good. Good. Oh, hot, man. Packed up there. A photo of you two is good enough. I was going to try to get a photo of Hayden, but he's wearing nothing that like stands out. <laughs> oh, yeah. We'll get the Sony out. Hey, Fee. Hi, you've got different colors. I never noticed yeah. you. Yeah, thanks. Popping. Yeah. I'm shooting a POV. I'm going to be taking photos today. Awesome. Yeah. So you're not riding? Where's your board? I'm riding, yeah. yeah. Is your board over there? Yeah, it's just over there with my bag. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's got the camera out. Yeah. Oh, nice. Say hi to POV. Hello, POV. How are you doing today? Today we're here at Mammoth Lakes and we're deciding to take some POV action of uh, me eating shit. Yeah. Uh, well, I'm actually taking film. Film. And, well, you know what? Why don't we just do both? Yeah. Fuck it. Volcano. 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 I don't even know how to say it. How was the first run? <laughs> um, yeah, it was all right. Uh, yeah, that's actually really nice. So if everyone like stands up here with Nick, well, I'm glad I've got the 16 or 30. No, 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 that's fine. I don't want to be in it. I'm the photographer. That's my duty. All right, you ready, guys? All right, three, two, one. Nice. I'm going to take one portrait. Three, two, one. Nice. Lovely. That's all right. Wait, can I take one more of my film camera? Hey, let's hold that, please. Yeah. Thanks, bro. Okay, this is the 50 mil, so... Oh, that looks so awesome, guys. Three, two, one. Nice. Nice one, get it. Uh, jumping on the lift for the first time. This is gonna be interesting. Let's see if we can take a photo up here of something. Something of the trees. Could get like a top-down shot of a snowboarder. Everything's so bright. I'm literally, I'm shooting at 1 1,000th. I'm in an aperture of F16 and it's still overexposed. Oh, that there's actually a great landscape shot. Right, maybe I'll get this snowboarder coming down here. Three, two. Oh, where'd he go? The trees. All right, I'm gonna see if maybe I can get one snowboarder. There we go. There he is, three, two. Come on, come on. No, not good enough for me. Not good enough for me. Why is nothing ever good enough for me? Come on, push me there. Push me there. Oh. <laughs> Better than falling over. Oi, Hayden, Scott, you ready? Three, two, wait. Nice. That was sick. That was a good composition right there. Let's hope I don't crash. Oh, bro, pray for me. Oh. Nice one, brother. I'm happy you're not wearing my camera bag. Oh, fuck. Here's Hados. All right, first run successful, no crashes. 
Thank fuck. Even this would be a nice shot right here. I think it would look pretty cool on film. Oh wow, I need to reel it back. Three, two, one. Oh, that's sick. That was, uh, that's actually gonna be a good portrait. I'm looking for variety, but we're on a fucking snow mountain. Like, there's not that much variety. Like, if you take a photo of the landscape, and you take a photo of someone snowboarding or skiing, and then maybe like a portrait or the woods, then you're pretty much, you've covered most of what you can get here. Don't you agree? I do agree. You could take a photo of some rocks. That would probably be the climax of like this whole <laughs> video. <laughs> That's the hard part, you know? It is. Figuring out what looks good, how to capture this environment, but also make every photo unique. So that's something else that I'm struggling with. It's not the same as like street photography in somewhere like New York, where you have like different like architecture and all that kind of stuff. You don't have that in the snow. You have to get really creative with how you shoot things and the way that you look at things. All right, round two. Good stuff. Whoop, 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 And we made it. I see a little, little jumpy jump. There. Oh, that would be, oh, but would you hit that? You have to gap it between the two little shrubs. Yeah, there's snow there though. That, that's a clear path right there. Oi, wait, 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 wait. Uh, so we're gonna shoot Josh going here. All right, ready. Uh, I've got the focus ready on that tree. <laughs> Don't worry, I got you mid air. No falling. <laughs> oh, that's so good. No, it's good. I love that. Hello. Hello. I might actually take the time to get my camera out here. This is the most like picturesque spot, I reckon. Well, wow, that's actually so sick. Nice. How's it going? Good. You want a Did photo? Or film? Both. <laughs> that's my film camera. That's my digital camera. So when you when it comes time to just eddy out, take a break for a sec. Yeah. Always use the very edge of the run if you can. Oh yeah, no, that you're right. That is a good idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because in this position, you may have people ski above you and below you, or right into you. Yeah, yep. Yeah. And so just for safety. Yeah, yeah. We'll move now. We'll move now. Cheers. That was a very nice way of telling someone off. <laughs> that was probably the nicest way you could tell someone off. I thought he actually gave a fuck about my photography for a second. This is one of the other lodges. I do coffee and stuff here. He's my best friend Hayden. Hey, here brother. he is. How are you? Good. Uh, you gotta take off your snowboard because we gotta go do a chairlift that's over the hill apparently. <laughs> Really? The thing I love the most about this place is the scenery. It is so surreal. What's been your favorite part of this trip so far? My favorite part of the trip has just been everyone just being together and everyone having a good time and like just, well, I suppose it's like you have your times where you're falling over and you're like eating shit and you're just not having a good time. But then like when people just get back up and they just try again and like you just persevere and you just, Cause like ski ski holidays are the hardest holidays because you just you hurt yourself so much but like they're the most fun because it's like you have that that fun risk involved so everyone's just having a fun time that's that's my favorite part of the trip i'm actually going to just sit here for like 10 minutes or so like i'd love to take photos of people doing that yeah i'm going yeah, yeah. Chris, I'll just sit with you. Um, if you want to stay we can just meet them after we won't we won't be long but how cool would taking photos of that be Hey, look at this guy. I think the Sony would be best for this. And to be honest, I reckon the 85 would just be way easier to take those shots that we're looking for. All right, guys. I know I said this was film POV, and now we're getting serious. Hey, boys. If I wanted to take photos, where would be a safe place to stand? Half pipe or that? Yeah, okay. Like here. Yo. Yo, Hados. Hey, us. Hey, um. You, you might be waiting there for a really long time, bro. Now look at this. 
Holy fuck, that was so sick. Oh, yeah, I got it. Uh, do, do you think we could go now? Because Scott wants to go up to the gondola, up to the summit right now. Um, and we want to, he wants to get some lunch and he won't have the chance to do it any other time. Yep. Because he, he has to return his ski. Nice. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, yeah, I'll come now. Alright, thanks bro. I mean, it was short lived, but holy fuck. The 85? Oh, oh, we got it! Oh my god, that's insane! Fuck yes, I'm so happy with that. That is actually so good. Fuck, I love photography. Look at that one. Yeah. How cool is that? Yeah, it's a bit, it's a little bit contrasty, but it's actually like, it's in focus. That is a sick shot. How cool, bro. He's getting a fair bit of air. Yeah, he got mad air. I think maybe like that one there. Yeah, yeah. Completely yeah. on the side. All right, you big, bloody, beautiful bastards. <laughs> Aussie man. Aussie man reviews anyone? Maybe. All right. So yeah, that was the photo that I actually decided to choose and vectorize. And it's just so spontaneous and coincidental that I literally went up there for two seconds. Hayden wanted me back down and we got the banger. I think the artwork turned out pretty clean. I added in a little bit of topography, a little bit of grain to add to that retro vibe because that's the kind of feeling and emotion that I thought that his outfit was really conveying. I mean, I'm pretty happy with it. I just did it today and I finished this video today as well. I hope you guys are enjoying the fast content and um, don't get fucking used to it, all right? No, but in all seriousness, I am enjoying having the luxury to just sit down, bang out videos. I am also looking forward to filming some content in the Netherlands. And that's why I wanted to get these past two videos out because they were holding me back from creating content here with the boys. New, exciting, fresh content. So yeah, that's pretty much it. If you wanna see any more of my artwork, head over and follow me on Instagram. If you wanna join the community, have some chats, or maybe potentially see me live stream, come over to the Discord. And if you wanna actually have access to some of the more exclusive artwork that I make and share with all my Patreons, then you can head over to Patreon and um, join that kind of secret little uh, exclusive community that we've got going on there too. Hit the like button. Consider subscribing so I can see you malakas again and I will see you all in the next one, alright? Peace.